Today at My Car Coach, we have the pleasure of introducing you to the Ford Focus 1 litre EcoBoost. This car is the definition of the automotive term downsizing. And what downsizing means, it describes a batch of new cars that have come onto the market recently, which make do with much smaller engines that are supp supplemented by either a turbocharger or a supercharger to give the performance of a much bigger engine but obviously being a much smaller engine you get the benefit with the fuel economy and the lower emission figures. This car is really revolutionary and it's revolutionary because it takes what is a small engine this is only a one litre remember literally measured from here to here and for you boffins out there this could actually fit on an A4 size piece of paper it is that small um, but it is able to pull what is quite a big car because Ford add a turbocharger and this really represents what downsizing is all about. It gives the performance of a bigger engine, say a 1.6 litre, but because it is literally only a 1 litre, you get much better fuel economy and also the emission figures are reduced to the extent that this car is actually exempt from paying any road fund licence. This being the smallest engine within the Ford Focus range starts at the price of just under £16,500 here in the UK. This model is the titanium model and is closer to £20,000. So for that you get things like the, the bigger alloy wheels, you get parking sensors on the front and the back. Also get privacy glass in the rear, that's obviously tinted windows to you and me. And as you'll agree the Ford Focus is it's a big car, it's, it seems bigger than the previous generation but it certainly doesn't drive bigger, it is, it's a car that very much shrinks around you and it still has those focus traits of being superb to drive, offers great steering, um, a great gearbox change as well and the, and the engine has to really be tried um, to be believed, it is superb, it's really powerful for such a small engine and for, so essentially this is a car for all you enthusiastic drivers out there. And if you just, just walk around to the back you'll still notice some design features like the new light arrangements that curve into the rear wing You've got some LED strip lights here, some Zenon LEDs, and they just all help to make this a very classy affair. Inside, Ford have really tried hard to make this a high quality affair, and it largely succeeds. I mean, this is um, it's a nice interior, it's certainly very modern. Um, you've got many LCD displays, there's one in the centre of the dashboard here, uh, which you can better see actually if we um, start the car up. Um, it's all just nice graphics. Um, it feels and looks expensive. You've got a Sony CD um, system here. It's a DAB radio as well, which is digital audio broadcast, I think. Um, it gives superior sound quality. You get all the digital radio stations as well. You've got climate control down here. There's lots of different gadgets as well. This car can, for example, park itself or can reverse parallel park itself, I should say. Um, the steering wheel is loaded with buttons and, and many different things, if you can just see that there. Um, lots of different gizmos as well, including lane, um, there's blind spot monitors on the wing mirrors. There's also a lane departure warning system, so if you're driving on the motorway and you slip out of your lane, it will vibrate the steering to let you know that you've, uh, you know, you're weaving out of your lane. It's spacious as well. Um, and the, the great thing with this is that with the engine, the one litre, it's fantastically good to drive. It gives a really nice uh, throaty roar. It, it sounds a much bigger engine than it actually is. The steering wheel feels fantastic in your hands. The gear lever works superbly and is just within a short grasp. Um, it's very spacious as well. Um, it feels a much bigger car inside when compared to the previous generation. Um, and yeah, it's it's nicely different inside as well, which in modern car terms is often a, it's a rare quality to achieve. I hope you found this brief review useful. As always, there will be a more detailed report on our website on the news section. And for all your car buying needs, visit mycarcoach.co.uk.